Hey, it's Professor Josh. Welcome back to another live. We got Monday night. We got Mystery Mini Monday. So Mystery Mini Monday. Um, some fun Mystery Minis this week. We got My Hero Mystery Minis going on. So we'll open those in a little bit. We'll let everyone come in. Hopefully everyone's having a great Monday night um, hanging out. I do have some mail calls to open, some other goodies to open up but I hope everyone's doing well. Let's see who's already in the house. I saw Sarah here earlier. Uh, hopefully you had something good for dinner. Uh, hopefully, and it's something. I know it always ends up back to food with us. Uh, Jeremy, welcome. Mr. Smith, Slapshot Pops. Hope your auction went awesome. I peeked in there for a little bit, probably 15, 20 minutes. Um, had to go shopping for groceries. What's that? You know, food, I guess. Um, a team games and toys. Welcome, welcome. Cheap pops, smiley. All right, a bunch of people joining us in the house tonight. Ego waffles. Nothing about that. Hopefully, no one, uh, no one took your try to take your ego waffles. You know, blue spirit. Welcome, welcome. Vin, what's going on tonight? So Brett, hopefully you're doing well too. Uh, like I said, we're having some fun. We're gonna open some mystery minis. The cool thing about it is I have one sealed case. And it's letter D. So the cool thing I like good and bad about minis, make sure like I like to know that like a sealed case has different number or letters on them. Um, so you get different variants of hopefully the more rare ones. Um, Cause there are two one in 72s um, with this lineup. So we got two ones, one in 72s there. Uh, we got a bunch of one and sixes, so we're going to probably get lots of doubles. That means some great giveaways for you guys. A boom, boom, boom. Cheers to that. Got it in my cup tonight here. Thank you. Thank you. Living the pop life. How you doing? And trying out all those new emojis. A couple new ones in the books, too, from last week. I think we only need one more channel member to get add a new one uh, for next time. So I think I'll, I have an idea on a cool chase one to add. I think I'm doing that. So yeah, bought some from Walmart. I know I, Walmart's crazy. I don't know if they have special, I, I know they have a special D series ones, which I want to get to because they have a couple different ones. I did not get a box of those. I haven't found anyone with a case of those. Um, but sometimes you just grab them. Like, I think these five maybe came from when, uh, some hot cash was going on or something like that from a uh, hot topic. So grab those Christina. Welcome. Welcome in the house. Hopefully you're doing well tonight. Hope everyone's hanging out and having some fun. Uh, we are definitely having some fun. Uh, got drinks, of course, some good drinks from in tonight. Um, yeah, checking out some of the different things, you know, definitely the channel membership's cool because I like I like the new emojis I can add. They're fun. Plus, you get your course, your uh, special little A+. plus. You get an A+, plus in my book there. Um, I had to join my own membership so I could have an A+, plus and use the special emojis. That's kind of weird, I think, but, <laughs> but I wanted to have it um, for my own membership. So, so I had to join my own membership there. Um, I might have some sodas to open. I have a box from Funko Shop, and usually that's my like bonus to get free shipping. I add some sodas. Um, I know in the video later for our premiere, we do have some free, uh, we do have some sodas to open, um, and then we have three mystery boxes tonight um, to open on the premiere. So I'm doing one from Pop King Paul, which you know always brings the fire. We got uh, the Nerdy Newt, um, which which is like a, a $50 guaranteed one pop box. So you're at least getting a $50 pop out of it. Um, so that's cool. And then we also have um, one more from J Navo toys, a $75 one. So some cool stuff. Oh, look at that. We got J unboxing treasures and thanks for becoming a member. And that makes it so I can add one more emoji. So I'll definitely have to add that emoji. Thanks for becoming a member and joining the crew. Oh, look, we got another new member. Awesome. So if you haven't seen, go back. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. All right. So thank you. Thank you. Uh, if you haven't seen, I think I have a little, let me see. I think I have a little banner overlay. Let's see if I can switch overlays real quick. 
So I got this overlay. It kind of shows a couple of the emojis and then, of course, the custom badges. They'll change the longer you are a member. Um, they actually change. So, like, the first month you'll see people next to their names and then more. And then we have some other emojis. So appreciate everyone that joins the channel membership. It supports the channel, and it's just kind of fun thing to do with the lives. And I like that I can add new emojis. So you might see, like, the emojis now. You see a couple of them um, on here, but now I think I have six. I can add the seventh, um, and I don't remember what's the next level I can add one more. I, I forget how many you can add up to, but it's kind of cool to do the different ones. Um, you, you might see a couple of the different ones being posted. So definitely, definitely, Teresa, I am looking thirsty tonight. So I appreciate that. Cheers, cheers. Oh, look at that. That's showing off all the different emojis there in the chat. So if you want to check any of those out, um, very cool. So fun. I appreciate everyone that has joined in. Like I said, just kind of a fun extra way to little thing that supports the channel, I guess, um, for all the lives and everything. Uh, so mystery minis. Uh, who? How many people are My Hero fans? Like, are you a My Hero? I have watched. I haven't watched the brand new season that came out, but we got up to, um, what is it, season five now coming out. So got through all of it. Uh, my son's probably watched it like four or five times, but this is definitely a cool show. I like this anime. I like some of the characters. I think like uh, the first season, you don't really get into it. And then later on, I definitely think you get more into it because they introduce more characters, uh, more of the storyline and some of the like, really what they can do, like some of the specialty moves and that, that, you know, anime's another like sense of superheroes, really. You got your hero, all your heroes. So uh, if you like superheroes, this is definitely a cool show to check out. Um, a lot of different ones. So a lot of different things. I'm looking forward to seeing what's in some of these. Uh, I do have some pickups. So I did pick up, did anyone else pick this guy up? So it's the Masters in the Universe GameStop box. With the He-Man, uh, it was on sale, I think, not this past weekend, but the weekend before, for like 10 bucks. So $9.99, uh, you can't beat that, because the pop in it is pretty cool, from what I remember, at least. I just wanted it mainly for the pop, but we'll see what else is in here. So let me, let me give this a little cut here. So check it out, because I haven't opened this yet. I haven't got one. I figured I wait on sometimes these boxes because half the time they go on sale. Um, some of them I don't, but most of the time I wait on them because they do go on sale at one point or another. So uh, let's see. Let's see what we got here. Masters of the Universe. Maybe if it wants to come open. All right. Boom. Yeah, okay. Oh, nice. So I love this little guy. Orko. Orko. Cool little pen. Nice little pen. I didn't even know that came in there. So that's cool. Oh, man. I do love the, the pen that comes with it. The Scare Glow pen. Now, if it glows in the dark, that's going to be awesome. I don't know if anyone else checks this out. But, yeah, when they went on sale, I actually was in the store and I saw one sitting there. So I asked her to ring it up to see if it comes up because sometimes it doesn't got to order it online and then they got to get it so definitely some cool stuff i have not seen this so i have not seen this welcome welcome jet funko we got uh funko brothers in the house a bunch of people coming in but uh yeah oh nice i'm not a big pez collector so if people are looking to complete their Pez set and still need that Pez, let me know. Especially if you're a Patreon, I can throw it in your box or something like that. Definitely I'll hook you up. Um, and then, of course, the pop. But first, we got a, a new, another new member. So welcome. Welcome, Smiley. Smiley Fig. Welcome, welcome. I'll drink to that one. Thank you, thank you. So like I said, we are doing the memberships. Put that back up in case someone just came in. I haven't seen the membership stuff. Um, I'll put that up. Gotta put this down. You can see everything on there. So we got that. 
going on. So that's cool. New membership stuff available. And then, of course, we are doing Mystery Mini Monday. So we got lots of Mystery Minis. And then we are um, doing some other cool things with the Premiere. But this guy, he's flocked. The crazy thing is he's flocked loincloth and boots. Who thought of that? Who, who thought, you know what? We should have He-Man. We really need a flock is loincloth. That, that's that's what everyone's been wanting and missing for the longest time. The flocked He-Man loincloth. Anyone anyone been writing into Funko for that? Who, di who did that? Jet, did you do that? Did uh, Nick, did you do that? Good evening, good evening. Jedi John, welcome, welcome. All right, so if you haven't hit that like button yet, too, if you're new, uh, don't forget to smash that like button. Always welcome to the channel, and I, I always appreciate the smash of the like button. But like I said, we're getting down into some minis here soon, and we'll do some mini giveaways as we go along, some fun stuff. Uh, I'll think of some fun different things to do with that. And then let's see. I do have something from the Funko Shop. I should probably open this. See what I got. I got like four boxes from the Funko Shop today. I'll just open one. How about that? I'll just open one instead of like four. I think that's good. Yeah, I don't. I don't get the flock little little boots and that. I don't. I don't know why. Yeah, I want that. Yeah, the glow and dark Todoroki. I haven't. I don't think I've seen anyone pull him yet. So. I would like that. All right, so we do have two sodas in here, and we have two pops. Oh, this is a cool pop. I've been kind of waiting for this one. This looked cool, and, like, people are sleeping on it. It stood on the shop for a while, it seemed like, the Funko shop. Dark side. This one looks pretty awesome. Like, I don't know why it stood on the shop for so long. We might have to open this guy up. Because he is big and hefty. We need to see what he looks like. Uh, trusty butter knife. I do have my pop protectors, too. I forgot. I found them, finally. All right. So let's see where we go. Flintstone chop. I know. that That is, if you didn't know... Teresa, that the the flint chomp up back there is a one in five. One in five, a custom for Smy World. So it was one in five. I think the only other person I know that had one that I know of, I think, was the Luau, and he might have sold it. He might have just decided he didn't want it and sold it. Um, but yeah, a lot of people really like that custom. But look at this guy. He is pretty hefty. I don't think he's heavy as Thanos. His head's pretty light. His body's uh, not as hefty. But I like the flames around him and everything. I like how he's standing. I like his pose. I like it's more of a action-y kind of pose. Um, they did a good detail with the boots and everything. It's just not flush against his body. I think they did a really good job with this pop. So I'm really surprised that it was uh, on the Funko shop for so long. But yeah, the base is nice. You don't have to worry about him falling over or, or anything like that. So you can put him up here, and he's going to stay there really well. So I think they did a good, really good job with him. I don't know why people didn't go after him. I know they put out so many of him, though, recently with the Justice League the movie, the Snyder Cut, and all the different pops that were coming from that. So I'll put them away a little later. We'll keep them out for a while. Yeah, almost a deluxe size. So if they can't fit Deadpool with his little, uh, they can't fit the Deadpool in his box, uh, riding on the little quarter horse, the coin horse, um, the, the cowboy Deadpool, Western Deadpool, whatever you want to call it. I don't know why, what they're thinking. All right, so I have two sodas here. So I might as well do these before I jump into the minis. So we got two sodas here. All right. I want to know in the chat, one chase, two chase, zero chase. What are we thinking tonight? One chase, two chase, zero chase. What do we got? Two 
just curious. I'm curious of what everyone's thinking tonight. So. Oh, zero chase. Oh, a lot of confidence in me. Zero chase. Two chase. I, I hope so. I actually just want this chase. I'd be happy because he's the only other luchador uh, figure that's out currently um, I need. So I hope a one green can. I hope you are right, Jay. I see one chase with the green can. That is what I need. I have the other one. Um, I wouldn't mind, you know, pulling it, of course, but... Let's see. So we'll start off with this guy just to see how he goes. We'll get a little tappity tap going on. We'll see if the force is strong with me. Cena, I hope so. I hope the force is going strong. Maybe I get some of Teresa's chase luck there. Need Teresa's chase luck. Let's see what we got. Give it a little shakety shake. All right. Do you guys want to see figure or pog? Figure or Pog? Let me know. I want to see what you guys want to say. Figure or Pog? I know if it was Secret Squirrel, it would definitely be two chases. <laughs> so, Figure or Pog? Pog. Bag. Open it. Open it. Pog. Oh, we're tying here. Figure. Bag. All right, so I see more bags. Let's open the bag. Let's go for it. Uh oh. It is just a common. All right, it's just nothing exciting. I don't know. These guys just don't excite me. They don't like their oh, how they look and everything. Just nothing. Uh, Nothing too exciting about it. Make sure I didn't get like a artist proof there sitting in there. That'd be great, wouldn't it? Artist proof and just say, "Yeah, I'm gonna give it away." Whatever. All right, so let's go tappity tap. All right, so two is out. Let's see if one holds. We'll do pog on this one for kick. We'll do pog. We're gonna get the pog going on. So we'll see. All right, a little shakety shake, got a little tappity tap. Let's see what we got. Ready? You guys gonna see it first? You gonna see anything? Anything? Ah, uh, this one will remain. So I just get one of these at a time when I need free shipping when I get something like that. So I always just happen to get one. Uh, but not too bad. Not too bad. All right. So we got um, all the my hero figures. And, you know, I wish they had all their names on them because I can remember most of their names. But it's a lot of times I remember like their. Uh... Oh, wait, this one might be exclusive. How did I get? OK, so this is from the same box, but this one has exclusives on it. Notice the three different exclusives at the bottom. These ones do not have any exclusives on them. How how this one get mixed in? Wait a minute. That is, I'm really bummed. I wanted all the exclusives, and I had a chance because some of them are pretty common exclusives. All right, so I'm gonna open that one first. What's going on, Anthony? Welcome, welcome. All right, so let's go. Let's go and open this one first. Let's see what we got here going on. Let's see. Use my little safety knife here. Easier. All right. So these ones, this box is the only one I had with exclusive, which is really weird. And then I have a case. So the case is not from Funko. It's actually, um, I got one from Parker um, on his auction a couple weeks ago, two weeks ago, maybe. So I got a case from Parker, and then I got a case from another shop. Um, and these are loose. These were from Box Lunch, but I don't know why only one of them has the exclusive in it. So if I get the exclusive, I'm hoping I get one of the rare ones, maybe. That'd be nice. Let's see what we got going on. So I'll keep this one so I know. I have to keep this box so 
I know the exclusives that could be there. I, I won't try to seal it up and guess. I'm hoping it's not one of the ones I can get from any other one. I'm hoping it's at least one of the exclusives. Let's go, let's go. I'm hoping I get that glow Todoroki. But let's see who's the first one. Oh, it's Tenya. Eh. It's not one of the exclusives, but I like his pose. This would make a really good pop. Like a pose like this for Tenya. I love the kind of the movement behind there and everything, the blue. That looks really good for his like kind of jet propulsion kind of kick there going on. Get what his move is called, his specialty move. I did, Anthony. I did get a um, Gem Pops mystery box. So I did get that one. I got it in the mail today, actually. Which I'm not surprised because I think live in Florida. He lives in Florida, so it's not that far. So let's see. Hopefully I get that. Maybe I get it out of one of these. Wouldn't that be cool? Not even out of the case. I mean, that's kind of, that's the luck you need is when you pull something that is not a, not a, that's really rare with just random ones. Like out of a case, you know, you're going to get at least, you, you know, you're going to get the one in 12s typically, and you're going to probably get maybe like a one in 24, two, maybe one or two, one in 24s and a one in 18 or something like that. Oh, great. You got yours too, Anthony. That's fast shipping. That's some crazy fast shipping, everyone. All right. The only bad thing about opening a bunch of mystery minis is first you get a bunch of doubles, especially if you open multiple cases. Um, but you also get a bunch of trash. <laughs> so we'll, we'll keep uh, we'll keep this. So let's see. Hopefully it's not another Kenya. But then when we get to the case, I'll open it up like we're opening uh, so you know which one it is because that's kind of important sometimes with cases. <laughs> All right, so I got my first double of the night. So I got my first probably giveaway of the night here. And what is he anyways? He is a 1 in 24. So that's not bad to get a two 1 in 24s. So we did get another 1 in 24. So might have a giveaway here. We'll see. Maybe I'll have a, uh, at least one more 1 in 24. We'll see what we got going on. So another Tenya. I know. Hopefully we didn't get a like a box of Tenya, right? I wonder that's kind of weird, but the one was a totally different box, the exclusive box, which I thought was really strange that we got. So we'll see. Oh yeah, the mystery minis Cardoon will definitely be uh, up there. Definitely people will be wanting to get her, but there's some cool ones. I, I did get two boxes of mystery minis. I think uh, Slapshot and I will be opening one with Joanna and Shannon, at least one each. So these are all uh, My Hero Academia, Academia Mystery Minis. These are five different just random ones. And then I have a sealed case to open still too. So you can see kind of, I think you'll be able to see some of the, there you go, some of the odds. So the one in 72 is the Glow uh, Todoroki. He's definitely a cool one. We did pull two Tenyas, one in 24. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, Bakogo, I like to get the just kind of the whole basic set. So if I can get that out of these boxes or at least close to it, maybe only missing one, I won't be too bad. Out of these boxes plus a sealed case, I know sealed case is going to have some doubles, so, so we'll see. But these are cool. Ah, uh, Chota without, I think there's two different versions. Maybe it's one of the exclusive ones. Maybe he has his glasses on or the, yeah. So this is pretty cool. One of the teachers, but cool figures. I mean, these mystery minis, they did a really good job. Some mystery minis look kind of cheesy and cheap, but all these these two have been really good, well done so far. So I don't know if anyone has checked these out yet, but I will say if you are a fan of My Hero, I would definitely get these uh, mystery minis. Um, if you haven't checked out this anime, it's actually a really cool anime uh, with superheroes and everything like that, so... It's definitely something you you definitely want to check out. All right. 
So we got another box here. Let's see if we can get something. So he's one in 24 too. So, so far we haven't hit any really, really common ones. Like uh, All Might is like one in six. We got a Deku is one in six. Uh, we got some uh, Todoroki or uh, what a, a Frog Lady. To <laughs> uh, what's her name? Um, I can't even remember her name. Like I always call her just Frog Girl. But <laughs> So she's a one in six too. So we, and then a regular Todoroki is one in six. We'll see. Uh, we'll see how we do on these. I will say though, you know, even if you're not, these minis are really nice. So if you haven't checked out these minis before, uh, these these are done really well. Like. I like the the zombie and, and Marvel zombie and Venomized line. I think they did a really good job with that line. Um, these they have done too. So, um, oh, we got Deku, Yuka Midoriya, also known as easy way to say is Deku. Um, he is definitely a one in six. So I'm guessing we'll get a couple of him out of this box. But we got one more kind of just uh, sitting here to open, too. So this is our last out of the five that I got, I think, from, like, Box Lunch or something like that a while back. And then we got our letter Case D. Case D for Dark Side. So hopefully everyone's having a good night. Um, any kind of... I just got a mystery box tonight. Um, I probably already sold out. Boom Loot sells out pretty fast. I think they only had five mystery boxes. So uh, if you haven't checked out Boom Loot, they always go live when I go live, so I always forget and miss them. Um, but today I was like, you know what? I'm going to get it. <laughs> I haven't got it in a long time. Um, so I went and got it. Um, so it looked pretty good, like six pops, but they usually have some good stuff in their boxes. Um, I've seen, I have gotten some really good pops from them before and good value out of their box. So definitely some cool stuff. All right. Let's see who we got. Oh, we got her. Oh, look at this. Look, I mean, how much detail? This is more detailed than the pop is. With her tongue all the way around and her hair tied into the bow. Love her hair, her face, the goggles. Everything looked really good. Like, it did a really good job with her so froppy yeah froppy is a cool one definitely definitely thank you christina yeah we're trying to get to 15 i mean we're almost road to 15 i'll probably do a giveaway at 15 um on a light like a live like after i hit 15 uh the next week we'll do a big giveaway uh, for a mystery box uh definitely um probably like a 50 dollar mystery box and then we'll be on the road to 2,000. I know Slapshots is on the road to 2,000. So a couple of us are trying to really push for that in the next month or two. Love to get there before my birthday. My birthday is May 20th. If I get to 2,000, that would be awesome. But I don't know if I'll get another 500 and some before then. But you never know. You never know what will take off or what will happen. But we got some cool, cool ones. So we have a couple of the one and six. This is another Froppy's one and six. I always call her Frog Girl. Um, but Froppy, Froppy's are one and six. I know 1K wasn't that long ago. That's awesome. I really appreciate, like, amazed by the support. Shannon and I are always amazed by the support of our channel. I know all of us at Popper One always appreciate everyone coming out and supporting all our channels, coming out and supporting our whatnot auctions, all that good stuff. So this is letter D um, for my hero case. I don't think it's a special edition case or anything like that. I wish it was. I really want the special edition case because that does have a couple others that I don't have. But if you haven't ever got a sealed case, this is what it looks like when they get in the store. I've gotten them before from a store, like right when they get them. I like, hey, you got a sealed case? And they're like, oh, we just got one in the mail. But so we'll, we'll uh, it's a easier just to open from the bottom and let it out. So we can keep it in order. Because a lot of people like to know the order. I don't know if anyone's like that. 
But if you know the order of a sealed case, you know what letter you at. Now, I will say every letter has different than exclusives to it. So probably everyone probably like placement and exclusive. So it's not going to do you any good to like know the order for any store you walk into. But it does nice to know um, when you get this. So lots of like they really protect these well. So there we go. This is what a sealed case is. So if you haven't seen a sealed case in minis, it's kind of interesting that they have them back, or maybe it was me. But no, these ones were like put backwards. Because these are backwards, these are forwards. That's kind of weird. Maybe so you can see what both are. But this is the case of minis here. Um, kind of shows you just a couple. It doesn't say like everything on them. Of course, you see it on the box. Um, what I've been finding though is these first couple, and I think the first two, like the first two in the bottom and top, the last box I saw was like an E, I think someone opened. Um, they actually, these were the exclusives. And then these were like some of the comments. So I don't know if that's still the case, but it's a sealed box. So we'll try it out and see what we get. We got a little bit before the premiere, so might as well break some open. We'll see what we get in here. Ah, cheers, Teresa. Cheers. Thanks. Thank you. Appreciate it. Looking thirsty. I was thirsty. Mm. Nice bourbon. Oh, bourbon ginger. All right. What do we think? Someone we haven't got yet? Oh, we have not got him yet. Oh, he's broke. Ah. But he's not really broke. Like, it looks like it just plugs in. So I think I can get him back in. I just have to be careful, I guess. That's not good for the minis. Uh, what is his name? I, I remember these are his hands of his family. <laughs> <laughs> on him, but uh, why can't I think of his name right off the bat? Shigaraki. Shigaraki. Thank you, thank you. 1 in 72. Uh oh, so this is probably our rare, so I don't think we'll be getting probably the Todoroki in this box, the glow-in-the-dark one, but that's awesome. So, so far I was right. Like Exclusive mini is the first one. Definitely will have to be careful on that mini right now, but uh, Let's open the other one. So that one was on this side. Um, we'll do the next one on the other side here, right in front. Like I said, I think some of these exclusives, from what I've he heard, they've been right in front. So if you see a brand new box open and no one has messed with it, I, I would say grab the front one so far. I don't know if other boxes have been different, but uh, yeah. He's definitely a rare one. One in 72. Thank you, Ryan. Yeah, that's that's pretty cool. All right, so let's go for it again. Uh, if you haven't hit that like button yet, let's get some like buttons smashed. And we'll open up our next guy. Let's see what we get here. I'm hoping something good. Another good one. Who am I hoping for? You know what? Uh, Chaka, Bakugo, Bakugo would be cool. I would like to get Bakugo. Oh, and it looks like he's just popping out. Like, this one's just, just, he didn't even like stay in the plastic. He's just like, I'm coming out. So it's a weekend All Might. Weekend All Might is actually a little more rare, I think. He is a 1 in 18. So 1 in 18, Weekend All Might, and his Weekend form as in, in a normal person form, I guess you'd call it. But all right, so I'm going to try this theory out and try these first two to see if these first two on the bottom are similar to being the more exclusive ones. And then we get to the commons like back to back to back. I think that's weird if they pack them like that, but I could see them doing that where they pack like, all right, we pack all the commons, every box gets these, 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 
And then here's some more rare ones up in the front. Um, I could see them packing that, but it could also be these two. So we'll see. So these are the bottom ones. One was right under the one in 72. I don't know if it is. What are we thinking? Bakugo. I'm hoping Bakugo. He's a 1 in 24. It'd be nice to have. So we'll see. Definitely uh, some cool ones. Oh, just regular All Might. So this is pretty common one. A 1 in 6. So it's not the case in this case. I'm wondering if the one right next to it's going to be a, another uh, All Might there. So cool. All Might. We got the Weekend All Might. We got the regular All Might. I do like, like I said, their stance and everything on that. But we'll try this. I'm curious if the one right next to it is going to be the same one. I, I've had seen that a lot where like the one right next to it is actually the same exact one. We'll try it out and see if it's the truth or not. We'll see what's going on. And I was right. Right next to it, we got our double here. Double All Might. I knew it. Like, right next to it is the one in six. So typically, like, one in sixes, they just put two in a row. So it seemed like that. Let's try this. I'm curious about the next top one. It's going to be a more rare or this. If that's how they're doing them or what. It's always interesting. I'm trying to figure out. They have to have some kind of system, right? Like, just like sodas, we typically know sodas, chases, when you have a sealed case, most likely are not in the middle, right? There have been how many times have we watched these? Um, uh, these? Yeah, you might not be a fan of My Heroes, but these definitely, these minis are some of the most detailed, awesome minis. Like, dude, it's, these molds are better than some of the pop molds. I, I love when they do that, when they can make a mini have a better than a pop mold any day of the week. I'm just trying to help Slap Shots out with his, his uh, anime naming. Uh, help him out here. Maybe do a refresher course for him. I, I don't know all of them, too. Santa knows more anime other shows, but I've watched all My Hero. I've watched all One Punch Man caught up on that. I'm trying to think of what else. Ooh, it's another Deku, which we haven't opened yet. All right, so... I'm guessing this is going to be another Deku. Let's see how right this this weird uh, situation is. So, so far in the case, we have an All Might Extra. We have a Deku Extra. I'm guessing we're guessing this is going to be a, another Deku. And, you know, trying to figure out, like, these like are great, I guess, if you walk in the store. No, but you're not going to know case numbers and stuff like that. But a lot of times, those first two I've seen in the last couple cases I've seen people open have been the more rare ones. Like, they put them in last, maybe? Kind of like sodas, you know, on the edge. Um, it could be the same idea. So, I don't know. What do you guys think? What does everyone else think? They think they kind of have, like, a system like that. Like, oh, we got to put these in, these in, these in. Um, it's how they kind of mix them in there. But how much do we think this is another Deku? How much do we think? It is. Look at this. Boom. Uh, I got the method down. <laughs> so we got uh, we got two uh, we got two doubles here. We got two of the good characters though. They're like everyone's favorite character. All right. So we'll we'll try a back one here. Um. Only there's only one, two other one and sixes, and then the other one. So there's going to be two others that are going to be I bet the same on the rows and then two that are going to be for, for the more uncommon ones. That's how it's going to work. 
I guarantee it. So whatever this is, probably whatever next to it is going to be the same exact one. Oh, it's Todoroki. I don't think it's the glow one, though. Doesn't feel like it. Just regular. But it's really cool. This mold is awesome. Like, that mold is really, really well done. Man. So that means we probably got another one of these right next to here. How much you want to bet? One of these is right here. Calling it. Todoroki, but I need that glow Todoroki. I don't know if I'm pulling that with a, with a, a friend here, our other 1 in 72. If one box has two 1 in 72s, that's a pretty awesome box. If you get a box that has two 1 in 72s, you're pulling some awesome. Man, these get too predictable when you start doing that, right? So we got another one. He's a cool character, and I mean, it, they, it makes sense. They put some of the most like favorite characters for people. Um, I think the three of them, the one in sixes, I'm surprised Froppy is a one in six. So let's see what this one, maybe it's the back. I'm going to skip the middle two. I'm going to go to the back two. Cause I'm guessing these back two are going to be, so they put two rares in common, 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 two rares. In. How much do you want to bet? Let's see if that, see if that holds out. I'm going to Froppy. I'm thinking is those middle two. I want to see if we are right in this. And if I don't get time to give these out on the live, what I'll do is on the premiere, I'll have you guys comment on the premiere, and then I'll give out some mystery minis on there. So I'll let you guys have some choices and some double mystery minis here. Oh, oh nice, a Chaka. So I was right. This is going to be another, what, 1 in 24 or 1 in 12? 1 in 12, and then I'm probably going to get a 1 in 24 on the other backside. And then these two are going to be froppy. I'm calling it. It would be awesome if we get another, a one in some, another 1 in 72. But, man, they did such a good job with these molds and the stands on them and everything. She does not like to stand. She's like falling over because her head. She does. She's like one of those minis that don't want to stand. So we'll see. A Chaka is pretty cool though. Um, so I'm guessing this will be one of our rares. I'm hoping back Bakugo. That's what I'm hoping for. I mean, Glow Todoroki would be awesome, but I don't think we're gonna get him. Um, we already got some of the one in twenty four, so I'm hoping not Tenya or. Uh, I'm hoping it's Bakugo, because then that means the only thing I would need left is the Glow um, Todoroki. That would be it. Of course, that's one of the 1 in 72s, so it's the hardest one to get. But I do have another case for another time. But that's the bad thing is with these cases, the 1 in 6s, you know you're going to get a ton of kind of uh, common. But this is going to be our other rarer one, I guess. More rare. So let's see. Ah, oh, we got another Tenya. So we did get another Tenya. We got Tenya out of the other one. So this is a more rare one, definitely. And then we're going to get two Froppies out of this box, I'm guessing, right here. Anyone who want to take bets? These are both. We know what these both are. I'll open them anyway. But since I know what they are, I don't want to leave them sealed. I'm like, hey, you want a box? I know what it is. I'll open them up. <sighs> so I'm missing Bakugo, which I could trade someone if they have a Tenya. Um, if anyone doesn't have a Tenya and they have a Bakugo, I will feel free to trade the Tenya for them. Um, and then we already have a Froppy over here. I definitely have uh, 
some giveaway if someone wants like choice between uh oh uh Farapi is not doing well wow these minis got beat <laughs> um Farapi is headless so we have headless Farapi here if anyone's looking for headless Farapi I have her right here um this is the ultra rare one that broke off so the head is so heavy the body is so light um this is uh, the first one I've had that was broken, too. I don't know what, what went on with these cases, but poor, poor Froppy. So I'm hoping we have a, a Froppy in here that is at least a one piece. So let's see what we got here. Yay, a Froppy in one piece with her head still intact. So we did have one casualty, but luckily I did have them in another one of these. So we have them all for this lineup, but two. So that's not too bad, right? Out of a case and then also the other ones. I mean, he's the additional one I got out of the others. So I am missing Bakugo, which I'll trade. I have some 124s if anyone has a, want to trade a Tenya for a Bakugo. Um, and then I need Glow Todoroki. I have not seen anyone pull Glow to Todoroki. I need to find a box that no one has opened. I definitely, I don't think, I don't think I saw anyone pull them. So I need to see what the, the other box was that someone opened. I think it was E. I need to remember what was in that one. I go back, but missing out on the other one. So, uh, so frustrating. So close. That was pretty awesome, though. We got we got close, and we got a big mess of boxes and uh, bags and all that good stuff for the mystery minis. I feel like we have a bunch of mystery minis, so we are pretty close now. So, but the ex exclusives, though, I need to get me some boxes with the exclusives. I mean, the ones aren't that rare. They're 1 in 6, 1 in 12, and 1 in 18. So you buy one case of the exclusives, you're probably going to get all three of them. Um, so I might need to find me a case of exclusives. So if anyone sees the special D-Series exclusive ones, a case of them somewhere, let me know. I definitely want a sealed case. I definitely want to get them. Eh, even if I have to buy like so many at a time, probably most likely since they're mostly one in six and one in 12, you probably will get them. Um, what we're going to do is I'm thinking uh, for the giveaway, the easiest way to do it, of course, random common picker and that. So what we'll have you do is on the premiere. So you have to come over to the premiere. So you join us for live. Usually you stick around for a live longer. I only do one hour lives on Mondays uh, for this kind of thing. And we had fun. We opened a whole case of minis and plus five more, plus opened some stuff from Funko Shop. We got Darkseid. Of course, he's a cool guy. If you did not get him, he's pretty cool. So what I'll do is do some giveaways for like um, maybe like two and two, a couple different minis. Uh, so I have a couple extra Dekus, a couple... I have three, ex two extra Dekus and All Might and a Todoroki. So I can give like two people two choices of minis to send their way. Um, and I'll, I can pick that um, later on. But what you can do is we'll go over to the live and comment on there. Um, hashtag my hero. I can M H M H A. Uh, with whatever comment after the premiere is over or sometime during the premiere. If you want to do that too, comment something else with it um, during the premiere in the comments, not in the live chat. So like this right here, the live chat, you wouldn't want to do it in, but actually on the video. And you can actually do that now if you want to. While we're, we're almost time to go over there. But let me pull up, pull up the link to the premiere. It should kick everyone over. It's been working really well. I don't know if everyone likes that. I, I took a poll, and everyone really liked doing the premieres right afterwards. 
So I would like to keep doing them this way. If everyone loves kind of doing the premiere and having some fun uh, at 1030, we do the premiere. Uh, like I said, three Funko mystery boxes going on. We've got nerdy newt, J novel toys and pop King Paul, um, which is really cool. And then uh, this is the video link. And yeah, you smash the like button, you comment. And if you're looking to win some My Hero Mystery Minis, comment uh, at when you're done with it and add the hashtag MHA. And I'll give away two sets of like Mystery Minis. Um, we'll do that. Well, we'll do it uh, maybe before the next live even. I'll, I'll just do the comment picker and pick them uh, tonight later on and then comment. I'll reply back to someone's comment who won. And then you can contact me on Instagram or I'll let them know how to contact me. If they don't have Instagram, most of you guys do. Well, most of you guys hanging out do. Um, so what's going on this week? So we only got about seven minutes before the premiere. Um, I had fun opening the Mystery Minis. Uh, we'll probably have another Mystery Mini Monday coming up soon because we'll have some Mando Mystery Minis to open. Um, so looking forward to opening those. Those are going to be fire. I'm looking forward to that. These were really good, though. I love the look of these. Um, only thing bad about Mystery Minis, like I said, when you open a case, to get those really rare ones, it goes kind of crazy. So uh, all those stuff. Boom. Look at this. Teresa showing up. Boom. Thank you for the... I, I enjoyed the polls. I think we did really well. Like I said, if anyone in the house has a Bakugo extra one and they want to trade for a Tenya, I'm, I'm down for it. I'll throw in some stickers and some cool stuff, too. Um, but, yeah, looking forward to uh, Pop Force 1. Of course, we have that on uh, Thursday night. Um, and, and Shannon and I are doing out uh, some Mystery Grail mystery boxes. So we pulled a Grail uh, the last time we did boxes. I doubt we'll put a, pull a Grail again. I mean, the odds of it are kind of crazy, but I think, you know, if nothing else, I'm going for enough points so I can get a whole case of pop shield armor. So a whole case of pop shield armor. Um, I think I need 16,000 points. I'm at 5,000 now. I think we have like 14 <laughs> mystery grail boxes we've been saving up to open. So maybe we can get some good scratch off points with that um, and get that box going on. And then, of course, PFO is going to be on Rock and Rose channel. So don't forget about Pop Force One. Um, also, on Saturday, Rock and Row and I will be dropping a special video where we're battling out our Plastic Empire boxes. The one pop, the one soda. We each got three of them. We're going to be battling those out. I'm looking forward to that. And then next week, on the 21st, not this Wednesday. This Wednesday, tomorrow, I think Rock and Roll is going on whatnot. Wednesday, uh, Pop and Duo is going on whatnot. But on next Wednesday, I'll be going on whatnot uh, for a happy hour, just a quick hour. And then the following week is the big, um, bigger one where I'll do uh, several different things where we have uh, more Dorbs, we have more Freddies. And we have some other things. So I'll have some pretty hot Freddies um, there um, because I actually bought a Freddy today. Uh, I bought a Freddy over the weekend and then I got the whole set I was looking for um, in one set from someone else today, which was a really good deal. So I still had that other one I bought the other day. So I'll probably be auctioning that one off, um, which is a hard one to get, too. I got it at a decent deal, so it's a hard one to get. Plus, I got a couple other Freddies. Like, I got, like, six other Freddies that came in recently. So we'll probably do a whole Freddy hour. I don't know if everyone's looking forward to a, forward to a Freddy Funko hour. Uh, let me know, because uh, we'll do a whole hour, probably, of Freddies. Another hour of maybe Dorbs. Um, and then uh, just some random other mystery boxes and that. But I'm thinking about soda mystery box for next week or a pop mystery box. Let me know in the comments what you would rather have. Would you rather have a soda mystery box with the, like one in five or one in four chase, depending on the price? Um, that's kind of like where the chases go at. Or um, would you rather have a pop mystery box where it's probably like hit or miss, but not too bad, or maybe like two pops um, kind of like that 25, 35 
something dollar. I have to have to look what I have, but pops or soda. Let me know which one. I got some cool grails. The, uh, some uh, maybe we can do one big hit out of it. But I got a bunch of other stuff in there. Um, and that will be for the following week. We'll do a different mystery box for that week. But I'm thinking for the happy hour one that's coming up um, on the 21st. I think that one will be a smaller mystery box run. Um, like I said, just like an hour or so of a variety of pops. And then the bigger week is my featured auction. The following week we will have a whole hour of probably Freddy's. Um, we'll probably do uh, uh, like Freddy's. We'll do probably the Dorbs. I got a bunch of Dorbs chases, some exclusive Dorbs, some Lunum Dorbs, all kind of good things with that. And then a couple others. Um, I, you know what? I have picked up a couple fig pins, but I didn't pick up the transformer fig pins. I don't know. I've been slowing down on fig pins. I have a lot of fig pins and I have not a great way to display them yet. So if you guys have good ideas on the ways you display your fig pins in the cases, let me know. But, uh, I have a ton and I have some of them. A lot of them, I get the box sets too. Um, I like the box sets. I have to unbox the Stranger Things one for you. I'll hold on to that, though. Um, probably do that, but some other gold things. I did get your box. Actually, I can open it. Um, got two minutes. Let's do it. I got it, and you got mine. Um, but I got your box, actually, today. And you helped me out with something I needed. I helped you out with something you needed. That's always a good thing. So let's unbox, Jeremy. We got two minutes before we go kick over, so might as well have some fun and unbox something else. I had it over here. Wasn't sure if you're going to be on with here or not tonight. So let's see. Good job packing. Made sure this thing was safe. All good. Put it here. Let's do that. I saw something else in here. I'm going to make sure I had that. Am I missing anything? I don't think so. Just the note. Just thanks for the trade. Enjoy, Jeremy. Thanks. And this was the last one I needed. And you'll see why tonight it's the last one I needed um, for the soda set here from ECCCCCCC. So let's see if I can get this open in one minute before we get kicked over to an end and go over to the eye. But awesome. It is the chase. The chase. Thank you for the trade. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoy your pop. And this is a pretty cool guy. I like him. I like I like this pose, too. I like this better than the common. I definitely do. So thank you for the trade. Always love getting uh, my soda set complete with trades. It's so much easier sometimes when you've opened a bunch. I forget how many. But definitely, definitely a way to do it. All right. So we're going to go over to the premiere. Hope everyone's ready for the premiere. Um, I'll catch everyone over there in just a minute. So we'll see everyone over there. We'll